digital illustrator Chiyo has found fame in Europe, Japan, and South Korea for his reworking of classic Taiwanese themes. Most of his illustrations revolve around young women, and his latest epic painting of Matsu is no exception. The great Taoist sea goddess is reimagined as a glamorous young lady, complete with maroon fingernail polish. A huge inspection tour painting also depicts many lesser gods of Mazu's retinue and a parade of people taking part in the traditional religious event. This coquettish Matsu has red paint on her fingernails and high heels on her feet. She's charming, intimidating, and stylish as anything. These extravagant paintings upend the classic image of the goddess as a solemn, dignified older woman. Artist Chiyo wanted to blow up the folk traditions around the figure. Matsu has an enormous number of believers, so that made me feel more pressure. How can I find the best form for this work? I feel like I really pushed myself to the edge. Chiyo incorporated classic decorative motifs from temple buildings into Matsu's makeup. He brought in dozens of Taiwan's endemic species of flora and fauna. Matsu's throne and crown are wave-shaped, symbolizing her power over the ocean. These two hunks at her side are reincarnations of her heavenly bodyguards Qianliyin and Shunfengler and many different temple dancers take part in this Matsu inspection tour. With his reimaginings of traditional culture, Chiyo won accolades at Angoulême International Comics Festival in France, one of the world's biggest cartoon festivals. Chiyo's specialty is charming young ladies. He's made a study of girls' high school uniforms from all over Taiwan. These youthful scenes won fans as far afield as Japan and South Korea, where a Korean version was published. The works reflect the atmosphere of contemporary society or the parts that are lost. A creator is actually just a mirror for society. Shiyo's pen reflects a certain bright and eye-catching side of Taiwan, taking traditional tropes and adding a 21st century twist. <laughs>